out of here, Pipe Smokers, and we're here with a Yabo and the video response kind of to Jay's question, but how you doing? Um, a little experiment that he had. First, I thought I'd show you what I just picked up at the dollar store. I already opened this one, but best candy ever. Also, best candy ever. I laughed when I saw Jay hold up his bag because every time I go in the dollar store, I end up getting a bag of these. Usually it's a bag of both. And, uh, but when I was younger, my grandfather used to give them to me all the time. And so I just, I grew up eating them. And, um, I really like them. And then, of course, I got excited when, when I opened up Stash Warden's, um, package, there were candies wrapped up in there as well. So, the Werther's. So those are kind of fun. Um, working in daycare, uh, I'm a daycare director. Um, so I see people all day long, and normally the first thing out of my mouth is, How you doing? How are you today? How's it going? I generally expect a response other than, Okay. Um, a lot of my parents, you know, I'm very friendly with them. As you, you know my personality, I'm pretty friendly with anybody. Um, you know, I love talking to people. A lot of times when they ask me, I usually tell them I need a nap. Um, usually because the kids get to take one, and I don't. I did get to take one yesterday, so that was kind of nice. Uh, but uh, a lot of times I get weird stories about, you know, what they had for dinner the night before, or what their kid did, and what they said, or what they said somebody else said, or something like that. So it's kind of funny. I get some very, very odd responses. I should t videotape some of those, I think. <laughs> but um, on to the Yabo. I got a Yabo from Tate, Smoking Pipeliner. Entered, uh, Mark and I did a little video response to his Granger, the best tobacco in the world video, and tobacco for president. So, got my package. Actually, package pr probably came Saturday. Um, didn't get it till this morning because I was I was gone this weekend, but I did open it already. So it is open. But here is my box of goodies. It's a big box too. I was really surprised to see such a big box out there. I'm also really surprised that it was still there. Um, so let's see what we have in here. Oh, well, there's a note somewhere. I had it earlier. What I did. Oh, there it is. And it says, Mark and Amber, thank you for the video response to my contest. Hope you enjoyed the tobacco. I included some aromatics and English blends. Hope this is some stuff you haven't tried yet. Keep making those awesome videos. I will be watching. Tade, smoking pipeliner. Thank you, Tade. It's been so long since I've gotten a Yabo, <laughs> or I've done a Yabo, I guess you could say. I haven't gotten any boxes. Usually they go get gold at Mark's house, so I told Tate, send it to me so I can do one. Uh, we have CND Autumn Evening. Granger, best tobacco in the world. I'll be the judge of that. We'll see. You're probably right. No, no, I'll take your word for it on that. I'm not going to take your word for it. I'm going to try it, and then I'll tell you what I think. Samuel Galwith Bracken Flake. Never heard of that one. This is a tobacco bomb. There's like never ending tobacco in here. Milan Chartwell. Kind of like Mary Poppins in her never ending bag. Which is pretty cool. Milan Centenary. Am I saying that right? Lamrick, which I've actually, which we both have had. I've tried that one. McClellan, McClellan's Dominican Glory. I'm assuming that says Maduro. Correct me if I'm wrong, Tade. Whoa. Esoterica Pembroke. And I know Mark is cellaring a tin of this and he hasn't opened it yet, so this will make him very, very happy. We'll actually get to try it now. We have a tin of Premium Mixture. Mi Tongue tied again. Premium mixture, extra quality, blended at the Malt House Tobacco Manufactory, Founders Reserve, aged 12 weeks. And then we have Cornell and Deal, Star of the East Flake. And this one says one half Cyprian Laudakia with a generous portion of Izmir. What's Izmir? I don't know Izmir. And sweetened with stoved red Virginia. Are that Mark's alley? This one is up my alley. Moulin Rouge Sutliff. Sutliff. I've tried this one. I like this one a lot. Thank you, Kate. And then we have 
Do you know what it is? Do you know? I don't know if you saw it. Do you know? Any idea? It says, even this is better than microwave popcorn. But no, it's a little backwards because this is the third time I've done this video. The first two, for some strange reason, have no sound. But they did when you play it, but when I went to edit it, it didn't play any sound. Jiffy Pop! Stoked up. I remember doing this when I was a kid with my parents. When we'd do movie night or something, we'd buy a couple of these and pop them in. It always the big silver dome. I don't think I've ever done any with bottom. I'll have to do one with her. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Tay. This is awesome. Major backy bomb, dude. You went way overboard. Cannot wait to try this stuff. I know Mark will be excited about trying stuff. We always like trying new stuff. Then I also wanted to show you guys the template for my bottle cap table. Those of you, most of you guys know, I've been asking for bottle caps because I'd like to have as many as I can. On this particular box, there are 40 different types of bottle caps. Not one has been repeated on here. It's just a little cigar box that I found. But this is kind of the idea of what I'm going to do to that table. So if you've got bottle caps, please send them to me. I'm going to go ahead and get started. So if you've got five or 50, I don't care. Um, please send them to me. Um, if you'll send me a PM, I'll send you my address to send them to. Um, that way I can start working on it and seeing what I have and things like that. So this is the idea. I'm thinking of doing a few more boxes like this, like for... Um, the ladies, we can put our jewelry in it. The guys, you have to wallet. You can store some more cigars, tobacco, pipes, whatever you want in there. But I thought it was kind of a neat little thing. Thinking about doing the edges, going all the way around it, things like that. So we'll see. It's a, if this is my project, or my practice project, I guess you could say. Hope everyone has a great night. Thank you again, Tade. Uh, greatly, greatly appreciate it.